Hi children, welcome back. So this video is for the fourth standard, and the lesson name is uh, Food, our basic need. Already we have started this lesson in the last videos, and we have discussed the components of the food. Uh, for example, carbohydrates, proteins, and even fats and oils. Also, we have discussed and what the carbohydrates are called as, what the proteins are called as, and what purpose they are used. This also we know very clearly. And in this video, we will continue with the next component of the food that is food fats and the oils as we know uh, even the fats and oils also give the highest energy to our body uh, similarly how the carbohydrates and the proteins will give and and even we know that from where we do get the fats and the oils see by eating the yog by drinking the milk by eating the paneer and by eating the drinking milk by eating the meat flesh fish and um, um, this is uh, by eating these materials and other than this by eating the groundnut seeds coconut and even the sunflower seeds mustard seeds or uh, these from these seeds we will get the oil also till uh, cashew nuts almonds pista so by eating these all uh, nuts also or from uh, some seeds also those have the oils within them so we can get the oils also from them or we can take them um, directly in our food also ghee main important ghee butter cream um, and um, yeah butter cream paneer cheese this all we will uh, use in our food item these all have the fats within them by eating them these the uh, things the fat is going to accumulate in our body and it is going to give us the energy when the body is needed when there is no food in our body so that time we will not die suddenly if suppose we will not eat for one day or two days isn't it so during those days these fats and oils are going to release the energy and uh, this is about the fats and the oils and next we have the uh, next component of the food is um, uh, vitamins and the minerals as i told you the components of food carbohydrates proteins fats oils vitamins and the minerals and yeah so these uh, different different things have the different different roles which are going to perform in our body carbohydrates will give us the energy protein will give us the energy to build the body and fats and uh, oils will give us the energy when the body is needed when there is no food in the stomach similarly what is the role of the vitamins and the mineral <clears throat> you might have heard already you are there in a fourth standard you might have heard the vitamin tablets these are the vitamin tablets you must take this one this is a vitamin b complex you must take this one because you are weak you have got the weakness we have got the nervousness in your body so even though we will get the lot of energy from eating the different uh, component of the food like that may be carbohydrate fat oil proteins even though we eat these all the food items and we have the energy sometimes our body fall ill of course this is just like a machine because of the weather because of the food because of the water because of the some other climate atmosphere infection viral our this machine is going to fall ill so during that time this body needs the energy which can fight against those diseases which have entered how the diseases we will get because of the virus and the bacteria which have entered from outside to our body then how these are going to enter through the food through the water through the air from the nose or from the mouth or through the Uh, yeah food also food means all will come in this vegetable fruit nuts whatever we will eat no the food will this food word will include then if once those bacteria and a virus have entered our body they may cause some um, unpleasant to our body or some diseases to our body those times we need energy to fight against those diseases to kill again uh, those bacteria and the viruses that time we need the vitamins and the minerals then from where do these vitamins and minerals will come so these will not come from any moon or sun children okay again we will get this one from the fruits from the vegetables 
nuts and pulses milk egg meat and the fish again we have these all vitamins minerals again in these items only if we eat the fresh fruit if we uh, eat the fresh meat if we eat the fresh um, um, uh, this one fish if, if we eat the fresh yag and fresh ju juices of the fruits or fresh vegetables fresh pulses um we will get the lot of vitamins and minerals to our body so it can fight again against against the diseases then other than this even we have some uh, minerals like the calcium iodine iron sodium phosphorus then again from where do we get this one again for example the calcium by the milk we will get lot of calcium uh, which is helpful to uh, strong our to make stronger our bones and the teeth then the iodine which will uh, keep away from the goitre the disease iodine by eating the salt and um, pure and fresh items we will get the iodine and then iron by eating the leafy vegetables by eating the apple by eating the drinking the milk by eating the fresh pulses we will get lot of uh, iron iron means which will help to increase the hemoglobin part in our blood that hemoglobin part is most important so like this we have uh, some groups of vitamins you might have heard vitamin a vitamin b vitamin c d e and the k these are the groups of vitamins and the minerals minerals this calcium iron iodine sodium phosphorus these all will come in the minerals children now you got if after seeing this video just you go through the textbook as i don't have the textbook i can't read the page to page so i can explain you in a round uh, round figure so after seeing this video you just go and read out you have some fruits groups there which from which we get the vitamins from vegetable groups which we get the vitamins again these only these fruits only the strawberry apple chikku guava and um, um, this one um, papaya mango these are the bananas and the grapes these are the simple fruits we get lot of vitamins from this and even leafy vegetables fresh vegetables normally we will uh, we can get these all vegetables around us every day again from this also we can get lot of minerals also and even lot of vitamins also so i hope you will understand this uh, whatever we have discussed in this video and uh, you will read the textbook before ending this video uh, what i shall give you the homework okay you can discuss about the groups of the vitamins all the groups of the vitamins from which food we will get those that particular vitamin and for what it is useful so you can write this brief answer and let us meet in the next video till then take care of yourself and bye bye children